Thank you to Dana who sent me the, the picture of the difference in the Kirkland toilet paper. It went from 425 sheets per roll to 380 sheets per roll. And it's a big difference, y'all. It goes quick. It's Costco time! Hello, my friends. It is finally time for me to get into Costco. I, we are out of everything. We're out of butter, we're out of broccoli, we're out of cheese. All of my main staples that I get at Costco, we are out of, and so I'm so excited to go in. So this morning, we woke up to 50 degrees. Okay, I know some of you guys are like, gee, it really 50 degrees, but here in Georgia, girl, that's cold. It's like fall just said, hello. Is it me you're looking for? And I was like, hey girl, yes, come on in. I'm ready for the fall, girl. I am ready for the fall. So I'm coming to Costco a couple of days before the new flyer starts, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you the new flyer because by the time this video goes up, the new flyer will be in effect. So let's go ahead and look in the flyer and see what they have. All right, y'all, so here is this month's flyer. It starts on the 29th, which when this video goes up will be tomorrow. Let's see what they got. I look through here. I want to say last week or so. I don't remember seeing anything, but let's just chat and look. They got the Ninja Blender. They have this air purifier for $99. It's actually a really good price for an air purifier. Electric kettle, $29.99. You know, honestly, guys, we got to start thinking about the holidays. And I'm going to start stocking up on some Thanksgiving food, holiday food um, staples, like butter you can freeze and chicken stock and stuff like that because they're saying how there's gonna, there might be a shortage and I don't know, it's like every time I go to the grocery store, either they're fully stocked or they have absolutely nothing at all. This is pretty, Miss Lazy Susan. Scissors and tape, what? Christmas is like, what, less than three months away now? <laughs> it's crazy, right? Where did 2021 go? Oh my goodness, the Christmas trees, oh, this is on Costco.com only, okay. I hate it when they have the flyer up like this instead of to the side. I feel like they could fit more deals when it's to the side instead of, or when it's horizontal instead of vertical, but all right, let's see. TVs and stuff. There's our couch. Usually they don't have furniture in September, which is weird. They usually just have furniture in July and in January, but this is our exact couch. We love this couch. So comfortable. It, it was so worth it to me. Um, and I believe it was this price. We might have gotten it for $19.99.99, I think. But now it's $24.99.99. But batteries, $3 off is a good deal to stock up on. I mean, it's not really much. Now this is a good deal. Huggies, $10 off. If you need those, this um, CeraVe moisturizing cream, $5 off. That's a good price. Because that brand can be kind of pricey at like Target and stuff. That's a good, pretty good price. $4 off the pads there. Uh, I don't really see anything else i was gonna try this brand of laundry detergent because i think i mentioned that the ecos i don't know if i really like it it's either our washing machine we do have a front loader or the ecos laundry detergent but my friend said she uses this and she really likes it so i might try that and since it's three dollars and 20 cents off for the whole month i may try it next time i go to costco sponges 350 off tide is four dollars off that's pretty good gain 360 off mm, those look good three dollars off of course, vitamins and stuff like that. This elderberry. Oh man, I'm gonna look to see if I can get a rain check, like a $4 difference from that. Cause you know, when I'm filming this, it hasn't started yet, but I might go back and get that credit for that. And that is it. Okay, so that is the flyer, but I have uh, everything I need on my Google Keep list, even though my phone is not really charge very well but we'll see how it goes i put everything i need in google keep i love google keep it keeps me organized especially with household stuff and i have different store lists and stuff like that but um costco is crowded i have realized that it does not matter what time you come it does not matter what day of the week it is going to be jam packed i mean jam packed i mean i'm talking i'm parked all the way the furthest the away that you could park and it's crowded back here so it doesn't matter even in the middle of the day People just come to Costco, so um, I'm ready for the crowds. Got my mask, let's get in there and get shopping. Oh, I also wanted to look at the new iPhones to see if they have them here, because I'm finally, 
finally gonna upgrade my uh, iPhone 7 Plus. Yes, girl, I still have an iPhone 7 Plus because, listen, this iPhone 7 Plus was not cheap and it was still working up until recently where it's really been just horrible. And so we're finally, my husband and I are finally gonna upgrade. These phones are so expensive, it's like, you know, it's like buying a computer. So, uh, girl, yes, I'm gonna use my phone as long as I can until it stops working. So I wanna go in there and see if you can actually buy an iPhone from Costco. We've never done it, so I just wanna see, I wanna actually touch the phone and see how it is or whatever, see how big and heavy it is. But, um, all right, let's get in there. Costco hit us with a nice blast of heat, which is nice. Why is this car bill so expensive? Jeez, $39.99, girl. For a faux thro throw? 60 by 70, it's pretty big, but $39.99 is expensive. What's the Hotel Grand White Duck Down Comforter? $94.99, okay. Oh, they have Hunter rain boots. $78.99, oh, that's nice, right? That's really nice. That's a, that's a good deal for Hunter Rain Boots. Oh, they have black also. I think I like the matte green though. If they had matte black, I would like that better. That's nice. Look at these fall pillows. I've actually took the time to change my pillows out for seasons. The only season I change out or holiday is for winter or for Christmas. I keep my Christmas pillows out for a while. But these are really pretty. Here they are. Here, they're only $9.99. Very thick, nice quality. Of course they have the Halloween. Oh, the Dawn is on sale. I'm gonna get some of that. It was on my list, but I'm gonna get it because we're about 75% done with it. Oh, I wonder what this smells like. Downy Calm. I know this stuff isn't really healthy to use, but the scents and stuff, but I bet you it smells, it looks, the, the packaging is what makes me want to smell it, because you know, I love purple. Anyway, it's on sale for $8.79. Tide Pods are on sale for $29.99, which is nice. Cascade Platinum, okay. Of course, the Halloween. I don't have much left for the Halloween. I guess everybody came throughout the whole month to buy it, but what is this? Is this Jasmine? Huh. I didn't know Jasmine had wings, girl. What's this? Oh, this must be like the latest Jasmine, like the live action Jasmine or Aladdin movie. I don't remember Jasmine having wings. Of course, they have the new Elsa dress too for Frozen 2. Cute. Halloween candy. Okay, let me go over here to Apple and see about the phones. Looks like they have them out. Oh no, these are the 12s. All the pumpkins. These are cute, large pumpkins. Maybe we'll carve a pumpkin this year. We've never carved a pumpkin. Usually I let them just decorate a pumpkin in the fall. Maybe they're ready to actually carve one. These are $6.99 each. Of course, they have all the candy you can think of. Cute sleepwear. Just a two-piece set though, and $17.99. It's a little, it's a little on the hot, pricey side. Let's see what else they have. It's a nice Tommy Hilfiger jacket. I'd be scared to get white though, to get filthy. Pullovers, kids' dresses. They have the clothes laid out a little differently today. This is cute. I'm here for the purple leopard. Is it a hoodie? Yes, it is. Okay, I'm gonna unfold it. And for the retail police, I will be folding it back. So let me just see. This is cute, right? Really cute. It's extra wide too. I probably just need a large, but. $14.99 and I folded it back. So cute, I've seen these here before. They're $12.99, still have a lot of them left. I feel like these will go on sale though, if I wait long enough. But how comfy do these look? I feel like my girls would love this. Just a lounge around, plus it glows in the dark. I think they would love it. This is cute, right? For a craft room, or a desk, or even your kitchen. It's a two-tier Lazy Susan by Mikasa. $39.99, but Mikasa's a really good brand. I've heard of them. It's very pretty. You know, years ago, they had this little handheld vac here, and I remember it being on clearance. It was a cordless vac for like 30 bucks, and I didn't get it because I didn't need one at the time, and now mine broke, and I'm like, I need one. What's this? This little Crossway Premier multi-service wet dry vacuum. No, I don't need that. I like this one. No. Oh, look at this air purifier. It's nice to have. Up to 360 square feet. $129.99. Oh, look at this big daddy of air fryers. Two baskets. 
How big are they? I want to touch the handle. Uh, the baskets are pretty small. But at least you get two. You can cook like two different things at once. $159.99. Do any of you guys have this? And do you love it? And I've been using my Instant Pot quite a bit. And I love it. And then what's this? The Ninja's Instant Pot. It's a, in, it's, wait, it's a pressure cooker, a tender crisp air fryer. So it's an air fryer and a pressure cooker? Huh. So that, this might be the Mac Daddy of everything then. Do you guys, any of you guys have this? Do you like it? Do you use it? I don't need any of this. I'm just looking, you know, just to look. These are cute, right? Camping mugs. I told Ava I would get her a little portable mug that you can drink something warm in because she loves hot cocoa and she loves tea. Are these? Yeah, $14.97, but it looks, doesn't look like they have any more. It's like a pretty good price for two. And I don't see them down here anymore. Look at this, stainless steel. With the straw, plastic straw. Okay, pretty. Thomasville Timeless Classic Rugs. I like this one, more neutral. These are pretty too, microfiber rugs. I need some new rugs for my kitchen. My rugs have seen the last, they're on their last leg for sure. Oh, look at this marble air mat. Um, yeah, it's like an air mat like you would put in front of your kitchen. I think you'd use this in the kitchen, right? Or do you use this in the bathroom? I think it's for the kitchen because it's super thick. Very pretty. You were like, have that beautiful white YouTube kitchen. I call it a white, white marble, white cabinets, YouTube kitchen. That's the look right there. I guess it came in these colors too. Oh no, no, this is the window panels. Very nice. Costco's really been coming home with the pillows. Like, oh, these are on sale for $9.97. These are on sale for but they only have this left, it looks like. They have those three. So, pretty. But I was just telling my mom how it's so hard to find twin comforter sets, because the girls need a twin comforter set. And, let me see. Uh, and these are kind of ugly, but I really want to let them pick out what they like, you know? But it is hard to find a twin. I mean, theirs is not extra large, long, but I don't know. I'll have to look on like Party Barn Kids. I know Ikea was sold out because I was going to get them a duvet for their beds, but now that they're getting bigger and older now. So if you have any suggestions, leave a comment down below. I've looked at TJ Maxx, like Marshalls. It's so hard to find a twin. You can find lots of queens and kings though. Here are the other pillows. So are these not the same pillows? On sale? No. Hmm. That's odd that the other ones are $9.97. These are $12.99. They're pretty though. I bought these exact bath towels for the girls. They love them. They love them so much. I said I need to get them some new washcloths. I want to just like slowly start getting them some new new ones because they need it. Which are they? A piece. See, the thing is, I wish it didn't come with the hand towel. We never use the hand towels. I just want the washcloths. That's it, you know? You just want the washcloths. I wish there's a way to just buy the washcloths. You know, I have to wait till they go on sale though, because I know I got those towels on sale one time for $4.99. They're normally $7.99. So nice, y'all. It's like better than my, than my hotel collection towels. And I love hotel collections, so these are really nice. Really nice quality. All the camping stuff on sale. Well, not really, except for that stealth camera. Everything else is just full price. It's so odd for them to have the furniture out. That's not normal. They usually have furniture out in July and January. Not in almost October, end of September. So that's very odd. This is a cute U couch, right? Looks so comfy. $11.99.99. Great for a basement or something. This is pretty, isn't it? Really nice quality. Feel it? It's pretty. I like the color. It is $9.99.99. Is it me or has the Hawaiian girls gone up? I mean, I know everywhere it's gone up. I mean, that's kind of redundant at this point, but everything has gone up at this point. Look at the dates. Wow, the raspberries are cheap. Sometimes these would be as high as $8.99. Let me look at them though. The organic ones are $6.49. I try to buy organic when I can. Ava loves raspberries. Absolutely loves them. Literally eats them every day. Tonight, I want to make some shrimp Caesar salad. Or maybe some salmon on the side with the Caesar salad. That sounds really good, right? 
I make a homemade Caesar dressing that's really good. It's the Cheesecake Factory recipe. It's really good. Let me just see if I can find a good thing of lettuce here. I'm not gonna lie, Costco's bagels are so good. After you have these, it's hard to buy the ones from the grocery store. <sighs> Should I get them? It's $6.99, you have to buy two. I wish you could just get one for $3.50 because I would just skip that. But, I know I can freeze some. I can freeze them if I really wanted to because they will perish in like a week if you don't eat them all. So, sometimes I'll get one from us and then one for my parents. Maybe I'll do that. Everything for us because we haven't had bagels in a while because I hadn't been to Costco in like a month. But I'm just looking at the date. Oh, it's one thing. His price hasn't gone up. It's actually gone down. It used to be $19.99 for the ground beef. Now it's $19.89. So that's a plus. Mmm, yummy in my tummy. Hey, yummy in my tummy. Whoa. This has gone up. The shrimp has gone up tremendously. Now, it used to be a four-pound bag. I can't remember how much it was per pound, though. It was a four... Well, I guess I could calculate it. A four-pound bag for... $40. So it's $10 a pound. But now it's up a dollar a pound because it's $10.99 per pound. Dag on, oh, that's expensive. Do I want to get the shrimp or should I just get the salmon for this price? Let me see how much the wild caught salmon is. And it's chicken tenders. These are four, five, six, seven, eight meals here. Um, these, how much are these? $5.49. Did that price go up? Because I wouldn't say they were used to be $4.99. I can't remember though. And at this point, everything is not up, so does it really matter? <laughs> Kleenex is on sale. $4.50 off. $12.49 and $13.99. Now let me see if they have paper towels and toilet paper. Thank you to Dana, who sent me the, the picture on Instagram of the difference in the Kirkland toilet paper. It went from 425 sheets per roll to 380 sheets per roll. And it's a big difference, y'all. I mean, we ran through this toilet paper in one month and that's not normal for us. It goes quick, which is unfortunate. I can't remember how much the price was. If the price went down, if this is $16.99, you can only buy one. But I cannot remember how much it was when it was 425, 425 sheets per roll. Limit one. I have to come back and get my parents some toilet paper and paper towels later on next week. You guys didn't know, I, I love Ecos. I've been using them for years. Well, I loved them. But I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's the same and if it washes. And I can't tell if it's my machine because I do have a top loader, or excuse me, a front loader. Or if it's the laundry detergent. So I think I'm about halfway done with the Ecos that we have now. I think I'm going to try the Kirkland brand because my friend uses that. And she really likes it. Oh, I didn't know they have a plant-based. They have a plant-based Kirkland brand. Has anybody tried this? If you have, do you like it? They have a free and clear as well. I wonder what it smells like. Oh, lavender, duh. I mean, anybody could say plant-based at this point, I feel like, but what do you think? Has anybody tried the Kirkland brand plant-based or the Kirkland brand detergent at all? Leave a comment down below and let me know. I cannot find the juice boxes that I got last time that the kids really liked. I think it was the, the Kirkland brand. Looks like they're all out, I'll have to wait. And I don't think they like the honest ones. Zara only likes either apple juice or lemonade. So I know the Kirkland brand had more apple juice in it. So I'll just wait till they get back in stock. Ginger juice, huh. Wouldn't it be better to just get buy the ginger from the grocery store and juice it or make ginger tea? I love ginger though. I would drink that daily, but not for $10.59. All right, I have good news and bad news. The good news is they have our beloved bacon that we loved so much and it was out during the whole pandemic. That you know, they, you know that they've had it back for several months. Girl, look at the price. Who is paying $23.49 for this bacon? Now the most I ever paid for it is $19.99. But $23.49? I just can't do it. I can't, I don't want to spend that much for that. Ah, this bacon sucks. I mean, it's so salty. It just doesn't taste like anything but salt. This bacon's so thin. I mean, it feels like you're just eating flavored paper. What's a girl to do? This bacon's $19.99, by the way. Now, now this bacon used to be like $13.99 or something like that. 
I know during COVID the pigs, the pig farms had a real lack and problem and sh shortage, but I just can't muster it to pay this much for some crappy bacon, especially crappy bacon. Plus the bacon doesn't quite taste the same. This apple, it's, I mean, it's better than any other bacon you can buy, but it doesn't, it's not as good as it was. And maybe we just got a bad batch, I don't know. But uh, I have to wait till that price comes down, girl. I can't remember if I reported back on what I, how I felt about this butter. I did buy this butter and try it. And I apologize in advance for recommending it because girl, it does not taste like this carry bowl. Nothing comes close to anything that I've tried to carry gold, nothing. It's 99 it's a little bit cheaper, but to me the bars were thinner. For some reason, to me the bars were thinner. Um, even though you still get four bars and it's supposed to be, what, two pounds? Is it two pounds? Yeah, two pounds of butter. It, I don't know, the Kerrygold just seemed bigger to me. Let me feel it. Let me feel this one. See if it feels like two pounds. Um, it feels about the same, but like I said, the bars were just thinner. I didn't like it, and plus it didn't taste as good, so. Always check the date, y'all. Look at this, December 7th. October 20th. Use by. Isn't that crazy? Oh, that's December. I'm gonna get some more chili powder, but they have this taco seasoning here. Has any of you, have any of you guys tried this taco seasoning? You know, we have Taco Tuesday or nachos every week, so. Should I try it? It's $6.99. I think I'm gonna try it. If it's not good, girl, it'll be coming right on back. Oh, Kirkland has their own brand of hemp hearts now. I still have some at home and I still add them to my yogurt and stuff. Oh my gosh, they have the applesauce cups, finally. Remember they were all out the last two times I've been to Costco, even though it's an incredible $14, which is to me ridiculous. I mean, I remember years ago when Zara was little, they were like $9.99. Now it's $13.99, but I'm gonna go ahead and get it. I'm gonna get some more vinegar. Why do I not see the barbecue sauce? Usually they have the Sweet Baby Ray's, anymore. Huh. That's odd. I just have to get it from Kroger. Oh, they're on the end cap because they're on sale, which is even better. They're $4.49, $1.50 off. Jeez, I was hoping the fruit snacks would be on sale, but they're not. Jeez, $14.99 for these organic gummies. The little, I like these because, well, the girls like them for one, and for two, the little bears, the little packets are small. They don't have a whole bunch of gummies in them. I mean, of course they love these. These are the ones I get at my mom's, but... Oh, I like to wait till they're on sale, but let me see if we have enough. Is this for kids? Oh no, it's for the whole family. Huh. It's $19.99 though. Ages 4 through 11, you take 2. Ages 12 and older, you take 3. I don't know if I would take this for Charles and I, but for the kids... I love Zarbies as a brand. They're cough syrup ever since they were little. Hmm, it has the C, D, and the zinc. You know what, I think I'm gonna get this. And then when we, when we run out of vitamin D, because I give them vitamin D every day. Oh, it's not a lot though. Should I get it for $19.99? I know Zarbies is high, but I'm gonna have to get it. Some more Motrin because I've been giving Zara some Motrin. She had like a little bit of a sore throat, but it's not strep, praise the Lord, or anything like that. So I did take her to the doctor, but. So I like to just have this. And you know, honestly, the last couple times I went to Walmart, it's hard to find the dye-free Motrin. All of it is either grape or, you know, cherry and all that. So I love that this is dye-free and it's only $8.99 you get three, because it's pretty expensive. Wait, I want dye free. Berry. What's the difference? Children's milk and dye free. Two four ounce. The three four ounce is eleven ninety nine. I don't see the two four ounce. So I guess you have to get the three four ounce. For eleven ninety nine. See how this is highlighted FSA eligible? That means that you can buy this with your FSA account. De debit card which is good to use because if you don't use all the money in your FSA, it's great to use it on like stuff like this. Um, prayerfully, if you don't have any like big medical bills or anything coming in and you need to use the money, you could use it on stuff like this to keep yourself stocked up. So just FYI, most of these are FSA eligible on this aisle. Ah, oh, I found one pack left. 
right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this because eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah. Yep, this is great. Okay, that's it. Let's see the damage that we're gonna do. Okay, right, I'm going back because I picked up a wrong one. The lady said it's not mold, it's just flour, but girl, uh-uh. I don't want all that on my bagel. So I'm gonna go run all the way back, girl. All the way at the back of the store. Um, power walking to get myself a new bagel. Bought the girls a jacket. I know it's $19.99 though for this little vest. Isn't that cute? All right, Gia, focus. Let me, let me go. Power walking. Now I gotta make it all the way back, girl. I'm out of breath, but it's all good. Get my steps in today. All right, y'all. This is the part where I'm like, oh, I wish the girls and Charles would came. Now I gotta hike all the way to my car, girl. All the way. <sighs> By the trees. Okay? Not these first trees coming up, but the, the last trees. Then I gotta get gas. It's all good, girl. We're, we're making it. I saw a hack either on TikTok, I think it was TikTok, where they said, leave an empty laundry basket in your car for your groceries. Girl, I'm looking at all this stuff like, yes, it would be great if I had an empty laundry basket in here. I could just put it in here. This wagon is for during boot camp when I have to lug all my weights. I, sh I just never took it back out. Anyway, it'd be great. And then I can throw all this stuff in there from Costco because you know, you, sometimes you don't get boxes and yeah, anyway. Just thought I'd share in case you all have trouble as well. All right, we're back home. Of course I got toilet paper and paper towels. All right, got some more barbecue sauce. I ended up getting the Zarbies Black Elderberry with C, D, and Zinc, vitamin C, D, and Zinc, which is for the girls. Some more Dawn, vinegar, lemonade, cookies, apple sauce, uh, tortillas, the Motrins, I got the two pack of Motrins, it was only $8.99. Sausage, Kerrygold, of course. Taco seasoning, I hope I really like this. Leave a comment down below and let me know if you've tried it. Wine rolls, bread. Of course, the two packs of bagels. Some, this is romaine, right? Yes, romaine lettuce for our Caesar salads. Broccoli, string cheese, organic gummies, organic raspberries, wild caught salmon. I'm gonna give one slap to my parents. Organic ground beef and organic chicken tenders. All right, I want you guys to take a guess as to how much do you think everything was. I actually don't think it was too bad because I did get the salmon and the beef and the sausage and the chicken. So that's a lot of meat, things that are typically expensive and the paper towels and the toilet paper. So, and then those vitamins were $20. All together it came to, I think $2.96. I can't remember, I don't have the, I left my receipt in the car, but I think it's $2.96. And so that's not too bad, right? That's what I typically spend at Costco once a month is like $3.50, but I know I'll end up having to go back in a couple weeks. I'm gonna go actually go back next week for my parents. So, sorry, I was so distracted. I let a fly in when I was getting the food. It's like driving me crazy watching this fly, like get out of here. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.